Hi everyone, I'm Siham Nashad, electrical engineer and PhD student in first year in National School of Applied Science, Ibn Zawar University. Before we start our presentation, let me take a time to thank all the organizers of this great scientific event. The subject of this presentation is modeling and simulation of the electrical behavior of a functional and faulty PV array. This presentation is structured as follow. First, introduction. Second, modeling and simulating a functional PV array. Third, presentation of some PV array faults. Fourth, modeling and simulating of a faulty PV array. And finally, conclusion and perspectives. As introduction, the photovoltaic system, similar to all industrial systems, can encounter malfunctions, faults, and anomalies during their functioning. But to maintain and increase their performance, the PV installation have to be monitored to early detect, locate failures and anomalies. As a first step, we tackle in this presentation the modeling and simulating of the faulty PV array by exploring various faults according to the stage in which they occur. But first, we need to model a functional PV array. This modeling can be assured by using the single diode, double diode, or the Bishop equivalent circuit. In our case, we choose the Bishop equivalent circuit because he can describe the system in all operating regimes by taking into account the avalanche breakdown effect. The following figure shows the current voltage characteristic curve of a cell's modeling by using the Bishop equivalent circuit. And the second is the characteristic the characteristic curve of an array of three string, three string connecting three models. Now let's move to a presentation of some PV array faults. PV array faults can be classified according to the stage in which they occur. For example, in a cell, we have the mismatch or shade faults. In a group of cells, we can have bypass diet faults. In models, we can have short circuit, reverse polarity, or connection faults. In a string, we can have corrosion of connection, length distraction, short circuit, or disconnected model. In an array, we can have destruction of the block and diet, block and diet, short circuit, or block and diet poorly connected. So, using current and voltage equation, we can describe each fault and model and simulate the system behavior. In this section, we represent, we present the result of simulating some faults occurring in cells and in model. We begin by cell's fault. We have the mismatch. The mismatch is the most frequent fault caused by grouping cells with non-identical current voltage characteristic. In this figure, we have 36 cells with a mismatch shunt resistance. And the second show the behavior of an array with nine faulty cells in a group with a mismatch type series resistance. Let's move to model faults. In a model, all faults are associated with connecting a model in a PV string. So the model can be short circuited, connected in parallel with an impedance, or can have reverse polarity. The figure show the behavior of the array in each type of those faults. So to sum up, in this work, we achieved the modeling of a functional PV array using the Bishop's equivalent circuit before moving to a presentation of the possible occurring faults. And finally, we model and simulate several faults in a PV system. But our general perspective is to develop a fault detection and diagnostic system in a PV installation and in a smart grid combining all subsystems using artificial intelligence. This conclusion breaks my presentation to the end. Thank you for your attention.